Hi guys, welcome back. Today it's all about white monochromatic outfits and how to style them. Bin petite, I love monochromatic outfits, as wearing a single color from head to toe can elongate your figure, creating the illusion of height. We can all agree that white monochromatic outfits can create a clean, chic and timeless look, but for a very long time I've avoided wearing white color, been afraid of cloth stains, thinking that the white items won't last long. But look, clothes are meant to tell the stories, right? So here are some tips to elevate your white ensembles. Starting with the first tip, which is to play with textures. Mix different fabrics like lace, silk, linen or denim to add depth and interest to an all-white outfit. Accessorize thoughtfully. Gold or silver jewelry adds a touch of elegance. Consider statement pieces like chunky necklace or oversized earrings. Add a pop of color with a bold bag, scarf or shoes to break up the monochrome look. Layering white pieces can add dimension. For example, wear a white blazer or a white blouse with white trousers. Add a neutral color toned or pastel colored layer like a beige blazer, for example. Combine various shades of white, such as cream, ivory or eggshell to create a nuanced look that feels intentional and polished. Consider your footwear. Nude or metallic shoes can elongate your legs and keep the outfit looking light and airy. Neutral and nude color shoes are especially flattering if you are petite, as they can help us look taller. White sneakers can create a casual yet stylish look, while white heels add elegance to more formal outfits. of transparency in white fabrics, choose thicker or double-lined materials to avoid visible undergarments. Nude undergarments work best to keep the look clean and polished. Opt for natural makeup with a focus on glowing skin to complete the freshness of white outfits. A sleek hairstyle like a low bun or straight hair can add the sophistication of the look. A statement belt, an oversized hat or bold sunglasses can elevate an all-white outfit. Ensure your white pieces fit well. Tailored white clothing can look incredibly sophisticated, while ill-fitting pieces can appear sloppy. And remember that unless the items are custom-made or made to measure to your body shape, most probably they won't fit perfectly. And I know this from my experience. Being petite, it's really challenging for me to find the right clothes made from natural fabrics. So after struggling for years, I found the Dressart, which is online styling and tailoring service, with the purpose to encourage women to embrace their uniqueness by designing their own clothes. One of the latest items that I was happy to design with Dressart is this amazing white trousers. And to be completely honest with you, I've been struggling to find the right pair for more than two years. I searched for it everywhere. I was actually looking for something made of natural fabrics, but I was also hoping to have the fabrics that could be quite fluid and flowy, um, not heavy weight. That was my priority. And of course I wanted to avoid any alterations possible because that always adds some cost to the final garments. And, you know, like I said, I was not able to find anything and in the long run I just decided to opt for custom service once again and design the pair of perfect ones. So designing your own clothes is actually very easy. Once you get in touch online, you will start working with a team of designers and stylists who would be able to help you find the most flattering silhouettes and once the design is confirmed, you will actually receive a mock-up item made to your body measurements. I will show you. So the mock-up item will be made from a different fabric, but the purpose is to test the fit and ask for modifications if needed. So I was able to see how the trousers fit and I needed to make them a little bit shorter. I just sent my comments to the team and the final item turned out to be perfect. 
So in case guys you are interested in this service, I will leave you a link below in the description box. Make sure to check that and if you have any questions, do not hesitate to leave me a comment and I would be happy to cover this in my next video. As always, thanks for watching and I hope to see you in the next one. Bye!